Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I know I haven't uploaded in a couple days. Just a lot, lot of things going on in my life right now. And plus, it was Thanksgiving. Spent family time. Family was over. Um, you guys know the deal. So if y'all had a happy Thanksgiving and if you celebrate it, hope y'all had a good time and you know had it filled your stomachs up and also had some good leftovers. So all that being said, we're back on the grind. I uh, got out of work late today, so you're gonna see the Jujutsu Kaisen uh, reaction maybe later. And I know I didn't react to Fire Force last week. I am gonna do a double episode reaction for this week. Don't worry, I got y'all. I'm trying to really come back and be on my game. It's just, I guess, doing Twitch streaming every day and stuff kind of on top of that, like work and then also having to deal with YouTube and all my own free time so I don't go crazy. It kind of, I guess, built up and I didn't really even realize that it did. So, all that being said, the first thing, which I didn't, I was waiting to react to this because someone mentioned that Zemo animation, which link in the description and in the comment section, they made a a Winter Soldier versus Guile like video. They are the ones that made King Kong versus Godzilla, which I reacted to a long time ago. Awesome stuff. You guys love that video. Uh, and also did Hulk versus Saitama, another epic video. You guys comment on a lot, even to this day, which I'm surprised about. But they did a Winter Soldier versus Guile thing, and I didn't want to react to it because I knew that the full version was going to come out eventually. You know what I mean? Because animation takes time. So I wanted to wait, even if it took like a year or like eight months, whatever. I wanted to wait for the full fight to be done to then react to the full version, which is what this is. This is the Winter Soldier versus Guile full version, Super Soldier's Clash Reaction by Zimmel Animation. And yeah, obviously I don't own this. I'm just reacting to it because this person does amazing, amazing animation work. And let's get into it. Link will be down in the description. Let's go. Before I start, I'm going to bet my money on Winter Soldier. Gaio is really ridiculously strong. But I don't know. I feel like maybe Winter Soldier, he has the Super Soldier Serum. I believe, right? Yeah, he has part of it. Or like, You know, he's very he's basically Captain America from Metal Arm instead. So we'll, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Because Captain America is pretty strong. I don't know if a Super Soldier is stronger than Gaio. Or Gaio is just so fucking strong they you know whatever but yeah let's get into it oh my god the most american thing to be like fighting in like the like colorado like mountains and rockies sent a team to track and capture him. This one, only one managed to come back. Apparently, they managed to track it down to an old ruined castle and proceeded to capture it. Oh yeah, Becky. Kid said this guy is not human. He can deflect a bullet and bent the rifle with his metallic arm. I don't know what Ooh, okay. Winter's they're gassing my boy up. Okay. I know what you're thinking, Kid. I need you to go in there and take care of this boy. I can spare you several men to help you out and take care of you. We've blocked every access to that ruin to make sure he's still there. Capture him if possible. But if you think it's impossible, eliminate him. Okay, I like how I like how they're, they're talking about like Winter Soldier as like an it, like not even as a person, like a demon. Also, is that like Thunderbolt Ross? My boy looks. He has that that Ross look, with that that heavy mustache. Also, I will try to pause if like I mean. This is a fight animation, so I'm more than likely just going to be reacting. But if, if there's anything that procs in my head, I'll pause to talk about it. Ooh. Wait, wait, wait. I was about to say... My boy, I, I I saw the fucking twinkling in the in the. Okay, I like this. I saw the twinkling in the top of the top of the building. I knew he was there. Did he? Oh, oh. Okay, Guile. He's not even talking though. Okay. Oh, 
Oh! Okay! Okay! No, dude, no, that was sick. It's essentially like two super soldiers going at it. Oh, I love, I love this close hand. This is so different from like the last two. Bro, this makes me want to watch fucking Captain America Winter Soldier. That movie's hand to hand combat was insanity. Yo, Guile fixing his hair! Sonic Boom! Yo, hit him with a flash kick! Hit him with flash kick! Okay, I'm rooting for Guile now. Oh, one thing I really like about uh, Zimo is the, like the, all right, since there's a little breather right here, is like the speed work, like the, the lines, the close-ups, the like, the tackles and stuff. I might, again, I'm just pausing here to just give thanks to, and like, you know, give credit where credit's due, like, in the animation style, or the art style, rather, very different from animation. The art style might not be like, the top is tier, and you might like think it looks very like, amateur-y, but I think what shines a lot is the animation like the artwork is you know obviously it'll get better you know over time and same thing with animation that's just how art is but Zimalt has a really good sense of like speed and like power and like and and knows how to use the space that that hand-to-hand -hand combat and that little like very thin corridor was phenomenal Oh, crossbones. What the frick? Why? Oh! Oh, I love this hand to hand combat. Axe kick? Knee? Ooh, look at yo Guile! Guile, okay. I underestimated Guile. I forgot he's just a muscle head, but he has mad skill. Suplex, yo! There it is! Flash kick. Yeah, I'm a thousand percent on Team Guy. I'm sorry, Winter Soldier fans and Winter Soldier. Sorry, Bucky. Very different from the last one, because, like, Hulk and Saitama was like... Yeah, I mean, you've been fucking getting your arm hit by that... By that fucking adamantium arm, like... Or, you know, vibranium, rather. Arm. I'm surprised I didn't break his neck. But no, yeah, I was just mentioning how it's very different from the last two, which means, like, in, ter in terms of, like, the type of fighting, you know, like, Sally Tower and Hulk, very, very fisticuffs, obviously heavy, and, like, just in, in general crazy, and, like, very flashy. And then you had Godzilla versus King Kong, which is also very flashy, but also, like, 
two giant monsters with like they're not human like you know proportions and stuff so I, i'm just really impressed as per usual with zim alt stuff only thing bro them sonic booms they're mad tiny <laughs> them sonic booms tiny So Gaia with an assist of crossbones. Okay. Walk with me, or I'll have to drag you. Oh, what the heck? Did his arm like? Oh, oh, it's like the system in his like. It's like a piston powered system. Jeez. Damn, Bucky. Bucky got a mean jaw. <laughs> oh, his arm is done. Oh, wait, Bucky, what the fuck is this? Wait, what What type of martial arts style is this? Oh, dented his chest plate. Ooh. Yeah, no matter, no matter what metal you got, you ain't, you ain't breaking or going through a vibranium or at whatever Zimalt went with vibranium or adamantium arm <laughs> pretty sure it's vibranium at least from the movies let's get rid of it Damn, a fucking sonic boom managed. Who the hell are you? A sonic boom managed to fucking stop Crossbones, but it, it did not stop Bucky at all. Really? You can't even finish him. Oh shit! An, a knife? Oh damn! Okay, so so tec technically, technically, I even mean, though I was voting for Guile, I was kind of right. Technically, Winter Soldier won the first round. Uh, okay, technically he did, because he knocked him out for sure. If he didn't, if if Crossbones didn't show up, he probably would have left somewhere. Oh my God, he cut his cheek. But technically, technically, Winter Soldier won that fight. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah, you can clearly see that that Guile. This is like showing Guile's like more expertise in terms of combat, because he's just he's just working crossbones. Look at this, disarming him. Fuck, dude. Oh, until Winter Soldier calmed down, he was just blocking and getting destroyed. Okay, okay, I'll give it to Crossbows. It's it's a 1v2 situation, but he, he he's holding his own. I'll give him that. Oh, 
Bro, both of you need to focus on a common enemy be before y'all head back to fighting each other. Wait, what? Wait, what the hell did he use? What the hell? Okay, that's, that's the highest we can go. I was saying it looked a little blurry, but what did he use? Was it just like an extra powerful piston? Or like an extra charge shot? It didn't look any cooler, like any different. I uh, do hear like an energy sound. I wonder what that is. Granny, he had a helmet on. Dog. Dog, he f do guile. He fucking bumbled him into this. Oh my god, that was awesome. Yo, credit, credit to Guile, bro. Uh, a, a human with no artificial enhancements, at least from what I remember, just a very strong, very... Uh, I mean, obviously he's somewhat superhuman, but... No metal arm, no nothing. Oh, oh it hit him! Hit him with it! Oh, fuck yeah. Where are you going? Wait. All right, Gal. Gal, you got to got to rest. You got to rest. You, you you fought two super soldiers basically. Well, one of them was a super soldier. The other was, like, super enhanced. With all these robotics. Okay, so he left, and my boy, at least he got crossbones. Epic, dude. Zimal animation. And carrot. Oh, well, man. Uh, oh, man. Obviously, all royalty free music. Very epic, very epic, very epic. Uh, what is it? Uh, again, credit to Zimal for that fantastic animation and to Devontae ja uh, Johnson. Obviously, go hit him up. If you're watching this, hit him up. Hit him with a follow, whatever. Because um, you voiced him pretty well. Obviously, I think if, if I want to give any criticisms for the animation um, or as a production on a whole is uh, just constructive criticism. Like, obviously, I'm not the... Like, I, I just know about these things. Obviously, in time, you know, I, I think Zimal will get, like, better equipment and stuff like that to do, like higher quality, you know, voice acting and stuff. And obviously he got someone else to do the VA. Um, overall, the audio, it was it was very good. But I feel like maybe in the future after, you know, obviously, I mean, he does fantastic animation. Like, I, 
Like the I think Hulk vs. Saitama has forty two million views, dude. And the King Kong and Godzilla one has like ten plus million views. So he knows what he's doing. I guess if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But just, you know, on a technical aspect, you know, maybe get some some higher quality like uh punching effects and stuff like that, sounding things, because it sounds very like very old school flashy, you know what I mean? Uh but you know, overall though, fantastic animation, fantastic work as usual. Uh it, it's just wow. Like I said, go hit up Zimal, hit him with a subscribe if you haven't already. I mean, if y'all watching my channel and watching this reaction, you probably already saw his video and you came from that that channel. Um but yeah, that's just my want like a couple criticisms of just of this video and overall I think his his animation in general, I think his overall like audio could be a little bit better. But just as a as a constructive criticism, it's not like hey, don't get me wrong, I'm not shitting on him, absolutely not. I'm just ch constructively giving him a little bit of advice, like maybe look up some higher quality sound effects for the punches, because the animation like is so high quality that I want like like the sound to go with it too, because it only goes up to 720p and stuff like that. So over time, you know, the more he develops, the more traction, the more stuff that Zimmel gets obviously the more i guess like higher quality like stuff we'll get from it but overall fantastic animation love this fight if i were to rank it between the th the two that you have on screen right now which is hulk and the godzilla one i'm probably gonna rank it oh man all three are okay i'll just say that all three are s tier i think i'm i'm gonna give this one i'm gonna give this one oh man I'll probably give Hulk Saitama number one, then I'll give this one two, and then I give Godzilla Kong three. Only because, oh, now hear me out, obviously they all have great choreography, but I'm such a sucker for hand-to-hand -hand combat, and the way, like, Guile and Winter Soldier were teaming up, and then Crossbones, like, I know Hulk Saitama's hand-to-hand, -hand, but, like, I mean, like, just normal human hand-to-hand, -hand, not, like, absurd, like, you know what I mean? Um... So if I were to rank it, I think this one's my second favorite. Because that little, like, hallway fight was, like, really cool. Like, elbowing, dodging. Blah. It was just magnifique. So, overall, loved it, loved it, loved it. Now I'm going to go ahead and record some other stuff. With all that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe for you. Go hit up Zimmo. Subscribe with it. Leave a comment. Give the video a like. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.